Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Andrea and I'm currently losing weight following the Slimming World plan. This vlog today is going to be a what I eat in the week. So I've done one already before, so make sure that you catch that. That was the previous week's. And this one is going to be the same. So it's going to run from Monday the 31st, which is today, right the way through to Friday, which will then be the 4th of um, February. And then I'll film what I eat over the weekend as well in a separate vlog. I'm doing it this way just because I find it easier um, to clump everything together and I'm not filming the full seven days because otherwise the vlog will go on for a million years and some. So yeah, this is the way that I'm just doing it for now, just until I manage to get a bit more time back and then I can continue to do the what I eat in a days, which is what this is, it's just lumped together, um, but I can start posting them daily. If you can hear hiccuping, I've just got little Kobe next to me. Aren't they, baby? 12 week old now. And he's got the hickey uppies. Honestly, kids, they just grow up so fast. It is ridiculous how quick they grow up. I can't believe he is 12 weeks already. Or should I say he was 12 weeks old on Friday. And then I've got Alana. Passed out, as usual. She loves asleep, this one. Um, she turns two in March. Again, can't believe it already. Is that because you want to be back on camera? Are you complaining? No, you want to go to sleep as well, don't you? Right, so, yeah, like I've said, this is going to be what I eat in the week and I'm going to disappear now because Kobe is demanding my attention. So, the next thing that you'll see is what I have to eat on Monday. So, I'll speak to you in a bit. So I'm starting the day having a cup of coffee using some of my first healthy extra A allowance of semi-skimmed milk. You can have 250 mils of that as a healthy extra. Excuse the white bits, it's just a little bit of cream out of the bottle of milk, um, but the milk is absolutely fine. I'm also having an apple, which is speed, and a kiwi, which is just free. So this is what I'm just starting the day, getting the kids off to school, so super, super busy. And I will pop back on if I have a snack, or more than likely, the next time I speak to you, it'll be lunch. So lunch today, because I enjoyed it so much over the weekend, I thought I would have very, very similar. Um, I'm having four of the Rye Vita Dark Rye Crisp Breads. You can have four of those as your healthy extra B. So I'm having all four of them today as my healthy extra B for my lunch. I've topped them with just four of these, the um, Laughing Cow Lightest Cream Creamy Cheese Triangles. You can have six of those for your healthy extra A or you can send them at one thin at each. At the moment, I'm going to have them as my partial healthy extra A, but I'm not sure what I'm going to have for my dinner later on yet. I'm undecided between a couple of things. Um, so it depends what I have for my dinner to whether I'm going to use them as sins or whether I'm going to use them as my healthy extra A or not. Um, but either way, I've got four of those triangles on there. I topped them with red onion, tomatoes and cucumber, which is all speedy. And then I've got a couple of boiled eggs, which are free in protein. And then all some gherkins on the side, which are also speed. So this is my lunch today. It's definitely my healthy extra B. But whether it's going to be my healthy extra A, like I said, is undecided. Um, otherwise, it could be four sins. We'll see later on, but I'll let you know. So this is what I'm having for lunch. And I'll catch you when I have something else to eat. So I know it wasn't that long ago that we had quesadillas, but they are back by popular demand from the rest of the family. And rather than making separate meals, I have basically succumbed to peer pressure. So I do know that I've got two of the Weight Watchers white wraps here. And it wasn't until I was halfway through cooking that I remembered that I've already used my Healthy Extra B today, which is gutting, but hey-ho, it is what it is. So I've got two of those wraps here, the five and a half sins each, which totals to 11 sins. Inside, I've got some of the corn, no chicken, I think it's called. I'll pop a picture on anyway, but that's sim free. And then inside as well, I've got 40 grams of the 50% lighter cheddar cheese. That is my second healthy extra A today. Obviously, I know that I've already had half of that anyway. So I'm going to count those Laughing Cow Lightish Cheese Triangles as sins, which was four. 
um, which means that my total sins for today so far are 15. So I'm right up to the cusp of my sins today. So yeah, I've got just cheese, that corn, and then I've done them in the frying pan with just a bit of fry light, so that's why they look nice and crispy. So all in all, 11 sins for those, and my healthy extra A, my second one for today. And then here I've got some thin free rice, which is just Asda's basmati rice, and the proper stuff this time, not the micro rice, because I don't have the sins to spare. Um, I've just fried them, again, some fry light in the pan, um, chopped up some yellow peppers, which are speed, red onion which is speed and then added soy sauce which is free as well so that's all completely sim free and then obviously the rice is free on Slimming World and as usual you'll be used to my salads by now I'm just serving it with a really large salad of mixed baby lettuce and tomatoes and cucumber so yeah that's it that's what I'm having for dinner this evening um, if, if I do have any dessert it's going to have to be fruit, it's going to have to be something sin free unless I'm willing to go over my sins and I would absolutely love to lose £4 this week so that would take me to my stone award so I'm going to have to have a really good think whether I'm willing to go over my sins and have a treat or a dessert should I say or whether I'm just going to stick to my guns and stay at 15 sins but I'll update you afterwards either way. Morning everyone. So I'm starting the day, no breakfast this morning, just a couple of couple of coffees, just a cup of coffee using some of my healthy extra A allowance of semi-skimmed milk and you can have 250 mils of that. So yeah, just not hungry this morning, which I'm not always and today is one of those days. But obviously I will be having some to eat for lunch because I can't imagine that I'll be able to go right the way through till dinner time without having anything to eat and I will pop on then to let you know. So as you'll have seen, I've had no breakfast today and for my lunch what I'm having is I'm having a big mixed salad. Um, it's all the baby leaf, you know, such as rocket and spinach, etc, etc. Big massive salad there. I've got chopped tomatoes, I've got cucumber and I've also got red onion if you can see it somewhere. Yeah, just there. They're all speed and then I've also got 40 grams of the 50% lighter mature cheddar just grated up and popped in there as well. And then what I'm also going to have is I'm going to have a tablespoon of this lighter than light mayonnaise just drizzled over the top and then I'm going to mix it in. So for my salad, it's just going to be half a thin because I'm going to have some of this mayo on it. And then I've also got one of these mug shots, which is the roast chicken flavour for two and a half sins. Excuse the state of the cup, but the pasta just wasn't getting soft enough, quick enough. So I popped it in the microwave and as you can see, it overflowed. So I'll add the cleaning of the microwave to my job of lists to do today. My job of lists to do? My list of jobs to do today. <laughs> so all in all, lunch today is just... Um, three sins, two and a half for that, one sin, not one sin, half a sin for this, and then it's also a healthy extra A. So like I said, no breakfast this morning, just really wasn't hungry, just had my usual cup of coffee using some of my healthy extra A allowance of milk, my first one, and then obviously this is my second one, and then I'm planning on making a curry for this evening, so I'm going to have curry and rice. Still got my healthy extra B, so I'm not going to, not sure if I'm going to use that for like a pit of bread or something, or if I'm going to save it for snacks this evening, especially because I went right up to my 15 sins yesterday, so didn't have any snacks, but we'll see. Either way, whatever I do decide to do, I'll keep you posted. Dinner this evening is a sim-free homemade chickpea and lentil curry. So everything that's in it is either speed or free. It's made using chickpeas, lentils, um, red peppers, onions, uh, coriander, garlic, passata, tomatoes, and then a variety of herbs and spices to make up the curry. I'm serving it with a pouch of the Asda's basmati rice for just one thing, and that's the microwavable rice, and then also a large salad of romaine lettuce, cucumber, tomatoes, and onion, which is all speed. And then just to the right there, you can see some sim-free coriander and mint sauce. And again, everything in it is either speed or free. 
just made using fat-free um, yogurt, plain yogurt um, with coriander, fresh mint, garlic, tomatoes, lemon juice and salt and pepper and I just blitz it all together and it makes one of these really authentic sauces and as usual serving it with some Pepsi Max cherry as well. So dinner this evening is completely sim free and I'll catch you for snacks. So snacks this evening are two hi-fi bars, the fruit and nut flavour as my healthy extra B. You can have them as your healthy extra B, two of them, or you can send them at three sins each. And I've also got a chocoholic white chocolate snack pot for five and a half sins. So another good day on plan, managing to stick to my sins. Really hoping for a good weight loss this week, but obviously time will tell. And I will catch you all tomorrow. So your eyes aren't deceiving you, this is my dinner and yes I've not filmed any breakfast or any lunch because I've not had any. Um, long story short, I got the opportunity to have a sleep in earlier on and I took it. When Kobe last night, when we went to bed last night, Kobe thought it'd be amazing to get up from three till five and it'd be playtime. I mean he didn't go down until about midnight and then he was up for the day at seven o'clock this morning. So with my mum being over this week, she sent me back to bed and I took full advantage of it. So I slept right the way through into the afternoon. I got up and I thought there's no point in me having anything to eat now because as normal, when I get up in the morning, I'm not very hungry. I wasn't hungry earlier on this afternoon, so I didn't have anything to eat. I just, I've just had a couple of coffees using my healthy extra ale ounce of milk. That's all I've had. And then I just thought I'll have an absolute huge dinner this evening. And that's what I've got here. So that's what's happened today. So apologies that there's no breakfast or lunch, but it's because I ain't eaten any. Um, so what I've got here now, we, I have repeated a few meals. You've probably noticed this week that it was only last week that I've had them and I'm having them again. Um, number one, I absolutely love them. So that's an absolute bonus, but also we, we have no oven at the moment. Um, the filament in it that heats up the oven, it's broke, it broke over the weekend. So everything that I'm trying to cook this week I'm trying to do without an oven. I still have the hob where I can obviously use pans and such but I can't use the oven and I can't use the grill so I'm having to like I say think of stuff that doesn't require any form of ovening and this didn't. Is ovening in even a word? I don't think so but I've made it up anyway. Um, so what I've got here for this evening is I've got these um, Warburton's soft pitters you can see there that one is your healthy extra b or you can send them at seven and a half sins because i've not had anything to eat yet today i'm having one as my healthy extra b and i'm sending the other one for seven and a half sins i've filled them let's spin it round i've filled them with that vivira shawarma kebab um, absolutely lovely. I really, really like this. So you will see it quite often because like I say, it is absolutely lovely. It's one and a half sins per pack and I have about three quarters of a pack. I don't have quite a full pack, but I'm just still going to sin it for one and a half sins rather than just messing about because then at least I'm protecting my own weight loss, aren't I, if I just round up instead. So I've got it there and how I made the kebab meat is I just fried it off with some yellow peppers that you can see which are speed and red onions which is also speed and then I used um, fry light to fry it and threw in the kebab meat and added some JD seasoning Donna kebab flavouring and some garlic granules just to give it that little bit extra um, flavour so again that's all free you're fine to have that on Slimming World. You don't have to count it for anything. And then underneath, I don't know if you can just see. Let's have a look if you can see another one. Oh no, you definitely can't see another one. But underneath, I've filled the bottom of the pitter pocket um, full of this salad that's here. So it is sat on a massive bed of salad as well. So as much as it looks like it's full of this kebab meat, it isn't actually. I'd say it's probably half and half. Um, so like I said, peppers, onions, speed. The kebab meat sinned for one and a half and then speed underneath 
and then one of my pitters is seven and a half cents and the other one is going to be my healthy extra B. And then in there I've got some sim free potato wedges that I've done in my active fry. And then I've got a massive salad of romaine lettuce, grated carrot, red onion. I've got some gherkins sliced up there. I've got some cucumber, tomatoes and... Oh, there we go. Pickled onion. Couldn't see it at first. And again, that is all speed on Slimming World. So that's what I'm having. I've just got a bit of salt on top of my salad. But then I'm also having some mint sauce that I make. Well, I say mint sauce. It's predominantly coriander, actually. That's what gives it the really green look. So to make this, all I've used is fresh mint, fresh coriander, green chilies, um, tomatoes, fresh garlic, fat-free natural yogurt, salt and pepper and lemon juice and just blitzed it all together and it makes this coriander mint sauce um, which is completely free like I say on Slimming World and it's just like what you get in the takeaways and I'm going to pop it on top of these kebabs as well and even drizzle a little bit over my salad because it's absolutely lovely and then my usual, you can't really see it on here but my usual Pepsi Max so that's what I'm having and in total, my dinner is a hefty nine sins. But like I said, I'm very happy because I just, because I've missed breakfast and I've missed lunch, which is naughty, but it's okay because Slimming World, you can literally eat any time. Um, I'm just making up for it with dinner. So I'm going to have this. I still have six sins. So I might have myself something um, sweet afterwards. I'm not sure yet. Well, let's face it. I'm, who's kidding? I'm going to be having something sweet afterwards, so I will pop back on then and let you know what I've had. So for dessert this evening, I'm having one of the Muller Light banana and custard flavoured yoghurts for just half a sin, and one of the blackcurrant and blueberry flavoured tenkal jellies for another half a sin. So that just means just one sin for dessert this evening. No chocolate tonight, which is very strange for me because I do love my chocolate, but I'm going to have these instead and just keep those sins nice and low. So another good day and I will catch you all tomorrow. Lunch today is a large speedy salad full of gherkins, tomatoes, romaine lettuce, grated carrot, cucumber and red onion. So I'll speed there and then I'm serving it with a chicken and mushroom pasta and sauce that I've made up just using water and just throwing in a little bit of extra soy sauce and garlic granules to give it extra flavour. And then I've also got grated over the whole of it 40 grams of the 50% less fat cheddar cheese as well. So all in all, my lunch today is just half a sin and I'll catch you for dinner. Dinner this evening is a pasta bolognese that I made. So it's some of the Sim Free Quorn um, Bolognese that I had in the freezer. Um, like I said, that's completely Sim Free. Quorn is free. The, it's got tomatoes and passata, onion, garlic and red peppers, which are all speed. And it also has some mixed beans in there as well, which are free on Slimming World. It's with twisty pasta, which is free, and I've just mixed it all through. And I'm serving it with some salad as well. Um, just literally romaine lettuce, uh, pickled onions and tomatoes, which are all speed. I've not got any cheese or anything like that just because I've already had my second healthy extra A today. So dinner this evening is completely sin free and I will pop back on when I have some snacks. So dessert is one of the Muller Lights vanilla with chocolate sprinkles, yogurts for half a sin. I've got a raspberry tenkal jelly, again for another half a sin. Two triple chocolate hi-fi bars, which I'm using them as my healthy extra beef for today. Um, or you can send them at three sins each. And I've got one of the Cherry Bakewell Bliss bars for five sins. So all in all, my snacks this evening are six sins and a healthy extra beef. So good day on plan and I'll catch you all tomorrow for another what I eat in a day.
morning everyone so i'm starting the day off having some fruit and a yogurt for my breakfast this morning so i know i don't normally have breakfast but i've woke up super duper hungry so this is what i'm gonna have um trying to keep it low in sins um my oven still isn't working so i'm restricted to what i can make and I just thought a bit of chopped up fruit and some yogurt is always a winner. So I'm having a cup of coffee using my healthy extra ale allowance of semi-skimmed milk like I always do. I've got the world's reddest apple there. Sorry, the camera's really shaky for some reason. Um, the world's reddest apple there, which is speed. I've got some blueberries, which is speed. And I've also got one of these Muller Light cookie dough flavour yogurts um, with the dark chocolate sprinkles. As you can see, just half a sin there. And then that that's glistening over the fruit is one of these, the Sweet Freedom. And as you can see, half a sin for a teaspoon. And that's what I've got just drizzled over the top. Just one teaspoon. So the yogurt, half a sin. The Sweet Freedom syrup, half a sin. So that means that my breakfast this morning is just one sin in total. And then, like I said, some of my healthy extra allowance of milk. Um... That's what I'm going to have now and then I'll pop back on when I have some lunch. I've gone for quick and easy for lunch today and I've ran out of lettuce so it means that I can't have a salad or anything like that um, for lunch so I'm just having some celery sticks. I've got three, they're really really long. I've got three celery sticks there that I've chopped in half each um, which are speed. I've topped it with Asda's fat free um, onion and chive cottage cheese which again is free on Slimming World. We've got some cherry tomatoes, just quartered, again speed, and then I've got a chopped up gherkin as well that I've sliced up and popped on the top there, which is also speed. I'm just gonna sprinkle a bit of salt and pepper over it and then serve it with a large glass of squash. Can't be guaranteed that this is gonna see me through until dinner time tonight, but like I said, I've run out of lettuce, so I need to get myself to the shop and I just wanted something really, really quick. I don't really want anything pastory or heavy because I've realised that I've had that quite a lot looking through when I've been editing this vlog. So I'm trying to avoid anything too carby because like I say, I am very conscious that I've eaten quite carb heavy this week when I've wanted to lose as much weight as possible. So I really don't think that's going to help me when it comes to the scales, but we'll see on Monday. Um, so yeah, I'm just having this for my lunch and then I'll pop back on if I should have any snacks or anything else. Dinner this evening is a vegetable stir fry. So I've not managed to get to the co-op or to any form of shop at the moment today. Um, so I've had to think outside the box because if you've been following me for a while, you'll see that I always add to all my meals salad because that's the easiest way that I can get that one third minimum of speed food into my diet. Um, but because I've not been to the shop, I've not managed to pick up any lettuce. I do need some more cucumber. Um, I could do with some more tomatoes etc um, but basically yeah I just need to pick up a few more fresh things so like I said this evening I've had to think outside the box and I've come up with this and actually it is really really nice because I've already had a little try of it to test what it tastes like and see if it needs anything extra and it's really really yummy so what I've got here is I've got some Asda's basmati rice that I just pulled out of the freezer I batched cooked a big portion of it and then just portioned it up and then threw it in the freezer. And I did this absolutely ages ago. So happy days that I've still got that. So no sins for that. Because I don't have any of the microwavable rice left anymore. And because I was just making this up as I went along. I couldn't be bothered um, cooking any rice from scratch. Because I always make far too much. Hence me throwing it in the freezer. But yeah. So basmati rice which is free on Slimming World. And then what else I've got in it is I've got red onion. Green beans broccoli, um, shredded cabbage, um, celery and Brussels sprouts. I think that's everything that I've got in it. Yeah, it is. Um, which are all absolutely um, speedy on Slimming World. I nearly said absolutely free, but they're all speedy on Slimming World. And then to flavour it, I've used some soy sauce and some Cajun seasoning for half a sin for the teaspoon that I used. So I have used a little bit of sins on this just to give it that extra kick. I've also used some fresh garlic and some garlic granules and a bit of pepper as well. 
not needed any salt or anything like that because obviously the soy sauce makes it salty enough but yeah really really nice so I'm actually quite glad that I ran out of salad because otherwise I never would have made this concoction and goodness knows what I would have ended up with instead but yeah I'm going to dive into this I've still got my yep I've still got my healthy extra B and I've still got another healthy extra A left so I'll see what I'm going to have for dessert because the size of the portions that I eat, I do eat quite a lot and everybody's probably seen that I do eat quite a lot. Um, this isn't the hugest because again, it was experimental. So I'll definitely be having something for dessert. So yeah, dinner this evening, free, speedy and just half a sip. For my snack plate this evening, because I've not had my second healthy extra A and I've not had my healthy extra B, I'm going to have them now. Um, that stir fry was absolutely amazing so I'm glad I filmed it because I'm definitely going to make it for the future so I've got this video as reference to make it again even my daughter tried it and she was like oh my god mum you need to make that again random but delicious but I think sometimes that's how things turn out the best don't they when they're quite random but anyway back to this so because I've not had my second healthy extra air I'm going to have three baby bell lights and then I've got some apple and a uh, satsuma them two are both speed the three baby bell lights are my healthy extra air for today and you can send them at two sins each or all three of them are your healthy extra air and then i've got two hi-fi my absolute favorite the fruit and nut ones both of these are my healthy extra beef for today and again you can use them for the same or you can send them at three sins each so yeah this is definitely gonna see me through the evening and I won't be having anything else to eat. So I'm going to pop this vlog up and get it uploaded. And then I'll be filming what I eat over the weekend for the over the next couple of days. So I'll catch you in a bit. So that's it. Another week done and dusted. Um, obviously, it's only the Monday to Friday. And over the weekend, I mean, today is obviously Friday. Um, and over the weekend, I'll be filming what I eat over the weekend. Just because, like I said in the past, I just find it easier to do it this way. Do Monday to Friday and then Saturday and Sunday as a separate one. Um, just because things are different over a weekend. So, yeah, really good week on plan. You'll have seen that I've managed to stay within my sins every single day. I've not deviated off. The only thing that's been a bit rubbish is with the fact that our oven is broken. And we're just waiting on an order for... A filament to go in the oven which is basically like the heating unit part of it so until that's delivered I've, I'm out of action with an oven but I do have my active fry which I can use as like a mini oven I suppose I've got my slow cooker the Hobbit is absolutely fine and I've got the microwave I've got a kettle I've got um, a toasting machine I've got all sorts of other random bits but when you're so used to using an oven you kind of get a little bit stuck for what else you can do without one. Or even if you're not used to using an oven, I think as soon as you've not got access to something, all of a sudden you think of every recipe in the world that requires an oven. So yeah, this week going forward, I'm obviously going to get the weekend out of the way. Um, but over the week, I'm going to, over the weekend, sorry, I should say, I'm going to try and think of different things that I can do that I'll use other appliances with. And also next week and over the weekend I'm going to try and do it as well but obviously I need to do a food shop so it might make it a little bit difficult I'm still going to be on plan there's not going to be any issue with that sorry I'm wiggling around because I'm scratching my back <laughs> I need to just stay still I'm like a child um yeah I'm gonna because I need to do a food shop it might be a bit difficult doing it this weekend but I am going to try and think of different meals next week that aren't going to be so carb heavy I've had quite a lot of carby meals this week, you know, with pasta, rice, bready stuff. I've had wraps a lot, pita breads a lot. So I have been very conscious that I've had those quite a bit, you know, crackers, things like that. And as much as they're all on plan and I'm within my sins and stuff, I just feel a little bit sluggish from it all. So I think next week I'm going to try and make sure that I up more on like protein and speed foods I think so like I said I'm going to use this weekend to have a right good think plan a really good meal plan out 
um and then i'm gonna go shopping either monday or tuesday probably tuesday um just because of availability of when i'll be able to go shopping so yeah keep an eye out for that because i will post what i'm planning on doing um and i'll probably post my menu plan on monday along with my weighing results for this week so yeah i'll i'll see how that goes because like i say I'm just, I've been far too carby this week and it has made me feel quite sluggish. I'm waking up in the morning feeling quite bloated. And again, I know that is just for the amount of bready, pastory, ricey stuff that I've had. So I'm going to try and knock that on the head a little bit. Maybe even do um, SP week. Maybe not an SP week, maybe a couple of SP days and then the other days. Try and keep the bread and the pasta and the rice a little bit to a minimum, but yeah. We'll see. So anyway, I'm going to say goodbye. That's Alyssa just walking in. Hello. So, <laughs> so I'm going to say goodbye. Um, thank you so much for watching. As always, if you like this vlog, if you can give it a thumbs up, it just helps along with the channel. And if you've not subscribed already, it would be amazing if you could. And I will catch you all after the weekend for my What I Eat in a Weekend. So I'll speak to you then. Bye.